Welcome to my channel, The Flix Judge, where you will get detailed reviews and honest ratings of global movies and OTT series so that you can watch only the best content worthy of your time. Today, we will review the web series Lutere running on Disney Plus Hotstar. A total of 8 episodes of around 45 minutes each. All the episodes of this series started airing a few days ago, or so Hotstar claimed. In the original, this series is available in Tamil, Telugu and other Indian languages dubbed versions. The series is directed by Jay Mehta. Lutere is a crime action drama series. The premise is totally new to Indian television or web series. In fact, there are many things that are a first for Indian content. First one is that this is a pirate action drama wherein a ship is hijacked by Somali pirates. The next one is most of the series happen inside a ship showing us in great detail the lives of the pirates, the hardships faced by the innocent crew members, the negotiations for the release, etc. Third is the location, which is said to be Somalia, but apparently the actual location was South Africa. Nevertheless, this is a series shot in Africa, that too with many lead and supporting characters who are African actors. This is another first for an Indian web series. These alone make this series a novelty and makes the case to watch it. The main story is the hijack of the ship by the pirates, the ransom demand and negotiation process and what finally happens to the crew. The story happens in the backdrop of political upheaval in Somalia where total lawlessness has started taking hold. Even a terrorist organization is trying to take control by toppling the existing government. This is a bad time to live in Somalia, especially if you are of Indian ethnicity and if you own large business interests. Vikrant Gandhi, our main protagonist, owns such an empire, which many rivals are targeting. They use the racial card to try and topple him. Vikrant has his hands in many illegal enterprises, which also complicates his position. This is a character whom you are not really sure if he is a good or a bad person. There is a lot of corruption, betrayals and violence that happens throughout the series. In the midst of all this, Vikrant is trying to get a hold of some special cargo in the hijacked ship and trying to come out alive as well as make money while trying to protect his business interests as well as his family. He has a wife and a teenage son. There are some more complications introduced by the family who are trying to look for a servant maid's son who has been kidnapped by a gang. Into the mix are the owners of the ship, Indian government agents, etc. What happens to the multitude of characters in the interplay of all these plots and subplots form the rest of the series? As I said, the first thing I liked about the series is the novel plot line, the location and use of original African actors. The shooting that happened on a ship and the African location adds so much authenticity to the story and the hostage drama looks totally realistic and very effective because of this. The next good thing is that how each of the subplots actually contribute to the behavior of the characters and make the main plot of the hostage drama move in different directions. The plot is interspersed with drama elements about the hardships the women crew face, infighting amongst the pirates, crew members, botched rescue attempts, etc. The drama element is kept at a very high level due to the multiple twists in the subplots and hence you are never really sure what would happen next. This makes for a totally engaging watch. The cinematography is good, be it the various angles shown inside the ship or the outside shots, they have all come out quite well. However, some of the night shots were too dark and it was difficult to make out what was happening. But overall, a good effort here. The other stunts and chase sequences were also reasonably good. Technically, this series was adequate. As far as acting goes, Vivek Gomber as Vikram, Rajat Kapoor as Captain Singh, Martial Bachman as Kareem the Pirate Captain and Athan Kosi as Kumbe have done quite well. Most of the other actors have also done well as per their characters. However, one thing that really spoiled the story quite a bit for me is the very over-the-top manner in which the main protagonist Vikrant Gandhi behaves. There is too much attitude that he shows. 
he misbehaves and abuses everyone at every opportunity not just his subordinate like gupta but the, the powerful policeman general walid his business rivals and even a terrorist faisal this is so absurd and irritating especially when he is touted to be a very smart and savvy businessman these tantrums really reduce the connect i had for this character not only him the behavior of his wife avika is even stranger the way she goes off on her own to search for her son's friend ismail right when the country is going through so much turmoil is totally inexplicable she too abuses her husband vikrant for absurd reasons but also does an abrupt u turn in the very next episode however some characters are well written the best are the pirates karim and kumbe and the dynamics between karim his brother and kumbe the crew and their dynamics are also good captain singh aisha are some of the key characters who are also well written but the one thing that really irritated me was disney hotstar which displays that all episodes are out i waited for all the episodes to come out and then watched this but as i saw the last episode i realized that the story has not ended instead here we don't even get to know the fate of the hijacked crew members some key characters get bumped off but there is no final closure for any of the plot lines everything is in a cliffhanger stage this was utterly disappointing for me that after having invested more than 6 hours i could not get closure on even one plot line this is not the first time disney plus hotstar has done this okay so what is the verdict lutere is a totally novel series which could have been a really great watch even though some of the issues i mentioned bring down the quality a couple of notches this is still an engaging watch a general audience will find something new in this series and crime drama fans will also be somewhat satisfied if you don't mind cliffhanger endings you can watch this series you can mostly watch with your family however there are some intense scenes and some bloody violence which may be distressing for children you should take a call depending on your situation I will give this series a 5 out of 10 stars. See you again with another review. Until then, bye and happy viewing. Thank you for watching. If you like this video, please like, share and subscribe. I go through hours and hours of content so that you can watch only the very best ones in your precious free time. Thank you.